A study released this week is linking birth defects to high nitrate levels in drinking water. Thanks for choosing 23 ABC News at 6. I'm Jackie Parks. And I'm Todd Carley. And those concerns have stretched across the San Joaquin Valley here to Kern County. 23 ABC's Leslie Marin talked with the health department about whether you have reason to worry. When you look at the study itself, it may not be conclusive. According to Donna Fenton, a health specialist for the county, residents shouldn't be too worried about a recent study that links birth defects to nitrate levels. Birth defects such as spina bifida, cleft palate, and missing limbs. It really does need more research before we can say definitively that there is a link between the two. Nitrate pollution threatens drinking water to over 250,000 people between Tulare, Fresno, and Kern counties. But Fenton says many people already receive filtered water. In most cases, um, you're on a water system that has many users and is required to reduce that nitrogen. And even private wells, which only provide water for up to four homes, those residents don't have to worry. Private wells with filter systems like these are what public health officials say keep nitrate levels low. Though nitrate pollution is being linked to the farming irrigation methods, Benjamin McFarland with the county's Farmers Bureau says they are doing what they can to keep levels low. My Farm Bureau has sponsored several bills to get money to those folks, to those communities right now that need these filtration systems. For now, both McFarland and Fenton say what's coming out of our faucets is safe to drink. Reporting for 23ABC in Bakersfield, I'm Leslie Mudding. And environmental health officials say to contact your water company and ask for a quality water report if you are worried about the water in your area.